you the things you should look out for in co-registration services. The things you should look out for in co-registration services. It's no longer news online that one of the fastest ways to build your opt-in email list is by using co-registration. You don't have to do any work. You don't have to go out looking for traffic. All you have to do is to pay some people and they will send you traffic. They will send people into your list. It is a very potent way. If you do it right uh, if, and if you get the right co-registration services. But you see, most of the co-registration services out there are not worth your time and money. Beware. Beware. That because of this, a lot of people do not make a success of co-registration. You see, there are loads of co-registration services out there, but very few of them are, are very, very good. Very, very few of them will deliver results. Okay, so I'm going to be telling you the things you should look out for in a college registration services before you decide to part with your money. Number one, a good core registration service must allow you to create your own campaigns and ads. This is important because a lot of services will just tell to you a list of people they got from pre-checked services or heaven knows where and tell to you. So a good courage service must allow you to create your own campaigns and ads. Run away from any co-registration service that doesn't allow you to do that. Don't listen to them if they claim credibility. Your potential subscribers must be able to see your ads so that they check it and opt in themselves. Okay? Another thing you should look out for is a, that a co-registration service must work with your autoresponder. A co-registration service must work with your autoresponder. This means that once your subscribers check your ad and hit the submit button, they must be automatically sent to your autoresponder to trigger your message sequence. Okay? A good autoresponder, a good co-registration service, sorry, must work with your autoresponder. You see, a lot of co-registration services will tell you they'll deliver, they'll deliver your leads in a file so you can import to your autoresponder. Don't fall for it. Not only is it a lot of hard work, your autoresponder service might not be happy with you. They don't really encourage importation of leads. Okay, you have to watch out for these two things. If you watch out for them and you're patient enough and you find a co-registration service that will fulfill this, then you'll wait a winner. Okay, so let me go over it again quickly. A good co-registration service must allow you to create your own campaign and ads. This is because a lot of people out there, a lot of co-registration services out there will just tell you a list of people they got from pre-check services. Okay, then a good core registration service must work with the autoresponder. This means that once your subscribers check your ad and hit submit button, they must be automatically sent to your autoresponder to trigger your message sequence. Okay, so please and please, no matter how tempting it is, never fall for any core registration service that will not fulfill these two things I've said uh, to have uh, shown you today. Thank you very much.